Here's some tips on some of Micron's cool features. Normally Micron stops triggering your camera when the duration that you have set ends. However, if you press the infinity button underneath the time, Micron will keep taking a time lapse until you turn it off. In addition, it's important to know that Micron remembers your old settings and every single time you plug it in, it restarts the settings that you previously had. And every time the LED flashes at you, it's taking another photo. Also, as a quick reference, look near the bottom of the screen. You'll see two small numbers. These tell you how many photos you're taking and how long the final video is going to be. You can find this on most screens. Um, in this case, it is between my fingers. The app by default calculates that you're going to be doing 24 frames a second and creates the video time based on that. Lastly, if you are shooting in auto or don't know if you're shooting in auto, make sure that auto is highlighted in blue on the screen. If you shoot in manual, make sure that manual is highlighted blue. This just allows manual photographers to shoot at intervals of less than half a second, but is not important for most folks and most time lapses.